How to make a fish grow lungs and breathe through its nose on land is not as complex as it seems. Cover the fish with wet straw to keep its body moist. However, the fish thrashes violently, and excessive stress from confinement leads to a sudden heart attack and death. This reminds you of Jesus on the cross, so you try fixing a live fish to a wooden board to restrict its movement. Unfortunately, before it can develop lungs, the fish, in despair, bites its tongue, and dies. Some problems remain unsolved. Then, you come up with another idea. Thread a rope through the fish's mouth and nostrils, cleverly bending its body into a bow shape, and securely tie the other end to its tail. Submerge the bound fish in water for two hours. The moment you lift it out, a miracle happens. The fish survives out of water. What's the truth behind this? The unique bow-shaped binding effectively suppresses the fish's violent struggles, slows its oxygen consumption, and forces its mouth to stay open, allowing it to breathe air directly. Congratulations, you've invented the jade tree technique. Not only does it enable fish to survive out of water for up to half a month, but it also greatly facilitates long-distance transportation and storage, even in today's highly advanced technological era. This ancient wisdom continues to play a significant role in the aquaculture industry.